close your eyes. Notice occasional images that flash through your mind. Your mind's eye doesn't see what actually is. Your mind's eye first creates, projects, envisions, and then it sees what it has envisioned. With your eyes still closed, try for a moment to think about tomorrow and notice how instantly your thoughts become pictures. You're watching a movie of your own making. You're trying to envision what hasn't, what hasn't yet happened. Our sensorium cannot see the future. There are no seers among us. Now open your eyes and return to the truth of your sensorium. See what actually is. Notice the basic truth of what you see, the palpable certainty of what you see, the unmistakable clarity of what you see. Pinch your nose for a moment and feel the rubbery skin underneath your fingertips. Feel the warm air on the palm of your hand as you exhale through your mouth. Hear the hush of the air stream as you exhale. You can trust your sensorium. Your senses generally don't lie. And if they do, they lie so well, so convincingly, unlike your mind, that you wouldn't know the difference between reality and illusion. There is certainty in this. There is consolation in this. Enjoy the certainty of your senses, the somatic body of truth, and return to it when feeling uncertain. There he goes again, you might think, messing with us. All these polysyllabic words, sensorium, somatic. If you don't know what they mean, enjoy this moment of not knowing. Knowing always begins as not knowing. Trust the process and let the body, not the mind, lead the way.